Hi, I'm Bruce Isaacson, Clark County's Poet Laureate, and I am here with Rel De Truth. He's a member of the Las Vegas Slam team. And Rel, I understand you guys are going to nationals in Atlanta. When are you going and how did you get involved in Slam? So um, we're going to Atlanta August 1st to the 6th um, for the national competition. We'll be representing Las Vegas there. Um, and we got, it was a competition, it was a season that all the you know poets had to compete in order to get on the team. So I'm one of four members um, that are on the actual team. And um, yeah, we'll be competing nationally. That's gonna be exciting. We're, we're all looking forward to having you guys represent uh, the Valley. Will you read a poem for us? Oh, definitely. Okay, great. If I don't thank you enough, I really wanna let you know that I thank you, God. I was broke as ever that day. You made sure that I ate. How could I ever forget to thank you, God? I know I should have read the Bible before I laid my eyes to sleep, you know. Way before I sent that last tweet. Way before I thought to make one last trip to the kitchen because I'm craving something sweet. Most definitely before I ask you for that new Jeep, that crib, or that new car, I had a nerve to beg for you to take me farther than you already have. Father, I just want to let you know that I'm so thankful for what I already have. Thankful for the people in my life and thankful for who you've removed in my past. I didn't see it then, but I do see it now. I didn't comprehend a friend could be so foul, but you never cease to show me the way. I ain't worried, cause all that darkness turns into light at the end of the day. It was God that made sure that my power was back on by the end of the day. And I'm still sitting here like, there's still no light to read the scriptures on a page. I'm still sitting here catching myself doubting my faith. And I don't spend enough time showering grace over my plate. I've seen you work in others and I just want you to work in me. I think I'm starting to understand why you made me to wear my pain on my sleeve. Cause man, I wake up, all these bills do at one time. Just trying to pray through it, get through it this one time. If I ain't got it, I ain't got it. I'm gonna get it and that's all that matter. I just wanna take my mind way above all this matter. Look at how they got us addicted to being social. Don't want us outside of our homes, but still social. Stay woke is the suggestion, but even if we know, still what are we to do on this quest then? They looking like, what are you saying? Remember, be patient. Just give me a little time. I wanna make sure I ask all the right and needed questions. Like, why is that white man that killed that black boy still free? And why do they hate Obama so much? And isn't he so much better than who we had previously? Stay woke is the suggestion. I'ma just sit here and smoke this blunt as I reflect in how this here not legal yet to the government stay woke and include they self on this billion dollar investment. Let my people free you making money off this street. Now you see where these so-called felons heads went. I just want to wake up from this dream. Poor judgment so I don't trust nobody. They don't want to be in my life but that don't kill my self-esteem. Ain't nothing wrong with me I just thought you was something to believe in. Who would have thought on my life this is how you'd be leaving. I was a real friend to you. You took my Loyalty, now you thieving. This here kind of remind me how ride or die homies sometimes turn into $5,000 nightmares. But you couldn't see the truth if it was staring at you from right here. Nobody around to trust, cause nowadays when you think it's love, it's really lust. I mean, nowadays you gotta sleep with one eye open, cause nowadays they're thinking of just shooting you in the face while you're sleeping. I mean, nowadays you just gotta stay woke, even while you're dreaming. Wow, Rel, thanks a lot. Thank that you. was great. The way your words roll the, are, is beautiful, isn't it? The way they, they kind of circle around there. That's great. And, you know, I want to tell you, if you want to hear the Las Vegas Slam team before they take off for nationals in Atlanta, July 25th at Hop Nuts Brewing at 7, isn't that when they seven start? 7 o'clock, Human and, Experience. Right, at Human Experience. And then on July 30th at the Truth Spot, 1800 Industrial. Is that 7 o'clock too? That's at 7 o'clock. And you'll hear the whole Las Vegas Slam team. And I also want you to be prepared on August 27th, Patricia Smith, the four-time National Poetry Slam champion, a National Book Award finalist twice, plus a, a, a National Poetry Series Award winner, a super powerful poet, is going to read in Las Vegas. So watch out for that as well. Hope to see you at Poetry. <laughs>